Hey, this is Ryan with Holloway Benefit Concepts. Today, we're going to talk about networks. There's a bunch of different networks that can be tied to different health insurance plans. They all have acronyms, so sometimes it's a little confusing following what they are. We're going to talk about the three most common today, PPOs, EPOs, and HMOs. PPO stands for Preferred Provider Organization. Most people who had plans five, six years ago and or in the group space today probably on a PPO program. They tend to have larger networks that most often are nationwide or at least more than regional, statewide potentially. Um, HMO stands for Health Maintenance Organization. That's typically going to be your smaller network. It's more controlled. Typically HMOs also do not have Adam Network benefits where PPOs would. Um, kind of a hybrid that's come out the last couple years is an EPO, it's Exclusive Provider Organization. With EPOs, you still get the large network, but there's no Adam Network benefits. So you've got PPO, which is typically the largest, also has Adam Network benefits. You've got EPO, still got the big network, but no Adam Network benefits. And then you've got HMO, which is a smaller, more controlled network with no Adam Network benefits. The PPOs are going to always cost a little more. EPO is kind of the middle of the road. HMOs, those are typically going to be the most affordable type programs, but they're going to have the lowest cost. Thank you. Appreciate your time. Please stay tuned for our next video, and we'll see you soon.